Yo, what's up? Doing another update on the Cutlass. Um, getting up into rebuilding this whole front end. I've got uh, the rebuilt control arms on here. Sanded them down, painted them, everything, primed them, everything. Ball joints are all in. Bushings are in. Control arms are on with the pivot bolts. Not tightened down. Um, not torque tightened down yet because we want to get the engine and everything on there before I start tightening my pivot bolts to spec. Um, and I'll just show you what I got going on with my tools and what I'm going to set today. We got coil springs, new Moog coil springs set for specs on uh, Monte Carlo 1985 350 engine um, we got the boots over there those will go up in the frame they're sitting on top of the coil spring compressor tool which I rented from O'Reilly here's the bay engine bay I've got all the suspension and steering components taken off cleaned up the steering box to see if there's going to be any leaks in there I'm just going to keep it there for now and see how it goes once I get everything back in there and the car running again. Um, I got the frame mounts on there, clamshell mounts for the SBC, all these bolts torque tightened down the spec. I think it was 80 pounds per square foot. Sway bars off and uh, just getting ready. All the suspensions ordered. Um, and I'm gonna do the coil springs right now and then get all the shocks, tie rods, sway bar bushings, center link, sway bar linkage, pitman arm, uh, all that on there. Then we're good to go. Cleaned up all the um, wheel components like the rotor and the brake caliper and the spindle took all that off and set it all back on there get her up and running with the new engine you know all, all new suspension because it's necessary um, to get those mounts on there I just went up through the control arm holes down here went up there's big holes in the frame you can just go up with extensions and knuckles and tighten all those bolts that's it for now